So this experiment particularly tries to see how classical music, symphonic music can work outside the concert hall and for a new audience. In particular, bringing it into a new space helps to really, we hope, break down the barriers between audience and performers. So basically what we do with Mala Amtish in terms of experiments are two things. The first thing is about the music of Mahler. If you take excerpts of Mahler from his folk roots, for example, and you let musicians play around that a bit and try to arrange new kind of music out of it, to what extent can you still talk of Mahler? What comes to count as Mahler? And the second thing is what happens if you just perform this not in a concert hall, but in a different setting, such as a bar? What kind of musical situation emerges? Er zijn heel veel regels in klassieke muziek eigenlijk die altijd opgaan. Um, wanneer klap je? Wanneer ben je stil? Zelfs wat voor kleding heb je aan? Uh, je weet eigenlijk niet altijd helemaal precies hetzelfde, maar in principe weet je hoe reageert een publiek. En hier weet je dat niet. Het spelen met een orkest in een zaal, daar zit heel veel meer concentratie. Het is ook makkelijker om je te concentreren. Ik bedoel, in de kroeg gaat de espresso machine aan en bestelt iemand wat en gaat een deur piepend open en dicht. In een concertzaal is dat natuurlijk anders. So for this project, amateurs and professionals collaborated together. They have totally different working styles, but actually in the end, it really, I think, worked so well. Classical music is usually not that accessible. I thought it was a good idea to discover what was going to happen. I really enjoyed that they combined this idea of having a very casual setting with the concert music. I thought it was a really fascinating way to like be more inclusive and more accessible to a general audience. So far I can't even out, but this is well a really good formula. Yeah. Everybody is talking about innovation uh, of classical music, but what it actually takes to do something different than the traditional roles and routines of an orchestra is often very unclear. So for us, innovation is about learning, learning to do stuff differently and learning uh, to together what works well and what doesn't work so well. Normaal gesproken speel je met uh, 120 een stuk en nu speel je dat met 5. Nou ja, dus je past heel veel aan. Maar uiteindelijk in de bar weet je pas echt wat er gebeurt. 